Okay, hello. This is uh, this video shows how to bring um, a pivot uh, object to your Microsoft Access database. In Access 2016, we ha don't have a pivot uh, anymore. So when you're there in a <coughs> in your uh, draft, you now let's fix that. <coughs> uh, you're not able to, you won't find the pivot here anymore, pivot uh, analyzation. So, uh, but sometimes you need this, it's quite quite useful and you have it in Excel. So, uh, what I do now is I show you how you make your uh, your pivot uh, analyzations here in into your access file. What you need, therefore, is uh, in your access database, you, uh, we, create, we create a, a simple uh, table, which is called, in, in this case, TBL Sys Excel. And I, uh, I have a, here an uh, uh, in, auto increment um, field and one field which is uh, including an OLA object. Just make this one and uh, change the field type to this uh, OLA object. I call it in this case OLA uh, object uh, Excel. And it's a simple empty table. <coughs> now what we want to do is we open, uh, we create a new Excel uh, file. <coughs> Let's call it demo 18 pivot. <coughs> and now I'm, <coughs> excuse me. Now I'm uh, creating this um, pivot in the Excel object, and I uh, bring back this uh, pivot into the access file. So what we have here is uh, we uh, generate a pivot table, and we need an external um, uh, source. Now for this we have to look up. Uh, on our database, what what is the source or the the entire path of this? Here's the object name. I copy this, uh, and now I make a new uh, connection to this file. So I say, okay, take another source and say a new source with further. Uh, File, uh, fur further uh, connection drivers. Here's the Office uh, 16 Access Database Engine or the 12 uh, Access Database Engine. This is from uh, Office 2013. So this is now from uh, Office 2016. Now go further. Here I say uh, the data source. Um, and standard is, uh, if you have a standard database, you don't have a, a password there, so keep this uh, uh, activated. You don't have this, uh, oh, no, oh, okay, uh, save, uh, save keyword, uh, allow saving keywords. So, <clears throat> okay, now like this one, if, if we go further, I will see here this uh, um, a query. <coughs> I named it PVT uh, underscore uh, Auswertung. <coughs> Excuse me. When I take this one, say uh, mm, save the uh, keyword there, a uh, password there, and now this is my <coughs> the name of this is in this case demo demo AT PVT. <coughs> That's the name which is available uh, after that uh, in uh, to the other uh, analyzations. Now we can say uh, uh, finish that. <coughs> I enter it here. Now here I have my pivot. <coughs> and on the right side I see I have in this case I have uh, that's the analyzation of uh, an area, um, a web area and I need the I want to count the visits there, how many how many visits were there, and take out the grid. <coughs> so 
sometimes the best is to take here and table options um, I keep the the width um, not automatically so, but uh, and the width which I manually uh, set up and then to take the classic uh, pivot table layout sometimes better so and here we making um, here an analyzation and the tab of the ribbon bar we have this uh, take a new create a new uh, pivot chart now what we we have this here okay <coughs> uh, maybe you take a, a further let's say like this design special design okay also this one what do they have there Let's take this one. Okay. Now I'm closing this file now. Okay. And now I'm going to my uh, access database. I'm opening my access database. And here in my table, I'm simply open this table. And now I take my Excel file and drop it in there simply drop it into my uh, field object field now it's cre uh, creating an OLA object in uh, in this this record set <coughs> now I took a um, it's a empty form and when we have this empty form we are going to take uh, yeah yeah <coughs> we are setting the uh, the record source. The record source is simply this Excel uh, table, <coughs> and in this Excel table we have uh, Excel table. We have um, uh, we're going to take in there the source field, and this is the first field. What what we have there. So now I'm, when I switch to the view side, then I will see the first record set. And this is the record set of the uh, pivot. If we want to mo modify this uh, pivot, uh, it's the, this pivot takes the data out of this query. And it's, but this is static. Uh, and if you want to change it or uh, uh, refresh the data, then uh, you're going here to with the right mouse click button we're going to the worksheet object and then we may open this file now we are in excel again in a uh, excel object it's really really it's an excel, excel object it's not the same um, it's not the same what we had here in our with my demo Uh, it's not this file anymore because we dropped it in there. Now it's uh, an object itself there. So we may co delete this, for example. Yeah, okay. I renamed it. So it's, it is still there. As, uh, it's not, not the file itself. And now we, when we're here in this um, object, Excel object, then we may open this file. And now we may refresh it. Analyzation. And now this works. Okay. Um, 